Yeah, but you got a gap in the middle, so that's another two. Maybe inch and a half, inch yeah. and three quarters can throw you off. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, you're, you're, you're way under. Oh yeah, you're good. Don't go past that line. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Hey, what's up, guys? This is Team Hard Life Captain Albert Sutter Blue Chair. I'm here at the Causeway Pier. We've got a gust and wind out of the north. Know, so we're going to see how the fishing how goes. Look with fish. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and also, too, anybody that doesn't want to be on camera, let me know that I record for my YouTube channel. So if you're catching a fish, I like to record it for them. If you don't want it, let me know. I won't record it. Shit, let me know. I'll, I'll hold the camera for you. I'll hold the camera for you. <laughs> I just got to ask before, you know. <laughs> Here at a private spot, sir. Right. <laughs> hey, we're going to let you know where it's at. We keep telling them it's... Um, we ain't airing it till we leave. <laughs> uh, what's up, Cameron? We keep telling them it's Labonte Pier. <laughs> <laughs> you get a lot of subscribers? Huh? You get a lot of subscribers? Uh, 13,600, something like that. Oh, that's good. One of, one of my videos is about to get a million views, so it's at 996,000. What'd you catch on that one? Uh, I didn't catch shit. Another guy was out fighting a big drum on a small rotten reel, and he's like, I didn't go for this or that. We had just told him like two minutes, don't cast out unless you want big black drum. He goes, well, I'm just trying for a little while. You don't catch them here. <laughs> big old black drum. <laughs> There it is. I got a surf weight on it too, so it's pretty good. <laughs> My original plan was to go fish the Packery Channel jetties. That's why I got all the light gear instead of the heavy gear, but we'll see what ends up happening. I'll be putting it to work, getting it out. They don't really have a big clicker. Yeah, I'm gonna go in there in a minute and get some of that beta lap.
So another thing is I'm going to start putting in little tidbits of knowledge as I go through the videos. Sometimes it'll be of me actually talking. Sometimes it's, you know, actually putting in the text and so forth. But we'll be putting it in there. Yeah, I went to the Jays looking for sheep head, but it got so windy and everything. And you'll see the next video. What I end up doing is uh, going back out there the following day and showing you what ended up happening so far. But it was definitely, definitely very sporty out there. Um, the inbound current had really changed up the water clarity and everything else. And it literally pushed everybody off the jetties and stuff like that. So... We'll keep passing on that knowledge and with our series of Teach Amanda Fish, it is po pointing out all the little details of what's going on and what's happening. And then too, you can also see from the previous, prior videos of water clarity in comparison to what it was in the next video. And then also too, you know, it, it's showing the real life, whether we catch or we don't. Or the, even the dangers, you know, I was walking on that area with the bricks at the jetties for hours and then right at the last oh, few bits I end up falling pretty bad. <laughs> oh, the magic for you. <laughs> the little reels that go, I ain't used to those. No. Oh. I got one of those, I just, uh, look, the, it's a Black Max or a Boo. Yeah. Garcia, just like that. But no, I was even talking about that spinning reel. <laughs> They, they sent it to me so I could do some spooling videos on my YouTube channel. And, oh, okay. So I'm, I'm fishing with it to fish with it, but... Not worth it. I'm not good with that. <laughs> <laughs> One fish here and there, okay, but, you know, I normally bring my kids and put them on it because they got the energy. You to the American Bank Center? I've been there a few times. It, it's all right. See, that's my spot. Right? Uh, that's some good I'm jumps there. Like this, dude. All of, I'll show you right now. My, I, every day I go, at least two, three. 48, I mean 48. 37, 38, 41, 33. I've got, uh, I went to Goose. I took my brother-in-law last week. We did about 40 of them in five hours. Damn. Uh, yeah, I was retarded. Three at a time. Ain't no yeah, it was, it was retarded. And what was that? Goose Park? Goose Island. That's where Santos goes from Bishop. Oh, yeah. yeah. Where's that one at? And Port Rockport? Rockport winner. We went over there on the jetties the other day. We were getting good bikes, but nothing was looking. Yesterday it was. No cheap hit. Yeah, I don't know. That was one of the uh, 44s. Oh, damn. Look at that, Cliff. Jeez. Motherfucker, that motherfucker is <laughs> 44, it was like 44 and three quarters or 44 and a half. Look at the blowfish. <laughs> Shit, the smallest one there was uh, 38 inches. Oh, damn. Nice. We would have had four, but the other guy... He threw it back right when we were picking up our fish. He thought we were just gonna throw him back. He, he threw his back and I was like, dude, like that should have been four we'll fish right there. Like, <laughs> we take donations. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh. Yeah. Bumped it about two, three times. That's a heavy class rod. It's a 120 pound. Oh shoot. Yeah, it, it, if it bends, it's because there's something good. <laughs> the light bend. That's what I said about this and that motherfucker. I just bought it. I said a few 7,000. That motherfucker bends. I'm on it. Mm hmm. I told you, as soon as you... Well, they all got it. pushed off the jetties. <laughs> I know I did. <laughs> I didn't even give it a shot. I was like, uh-uh. Good. Was it full out there? No, it's empty. Really? Yeah, it, it, when I when I drove by going to Port A because I was doing a delivery, there was a lot of people. And then on the way back, the winds picked up, and then they were gone in about half an hour. 
And yeah, got some important things coming down the pipeline as well. So we'll keep it with our rod builders and much more. So we'll see how it all goes. about to get down but I'm glad I did. <laughs> See where it is right there? I'll catch it as a game. Stay like this, it'd be bad. Yeah. You know better than that. <laughs> <laughs> That's crab or just regular? Um, I've got crab and shrimp flavor. Oh, good. Some shrimp there. Hey, hey, the pink one. Uh oh, that's it. That was just a wrap. 
Take it, let him run. I got 400. Taking it. I got 400 lines, he gets oh, tired. Gosh. I got 400 yards of 60 on there. Oh, he, okay. can, he can run. He can't hide, though. <laughs> All I hear is beep beep <laughs> the fucking bus coming. <laughs> You'll just sit in there? <laughs> That's a good keeper right there. Keeper. Good shot. Definitely bigger than the last one. Oh. 
Yeah, man, I'm gonna fucking take off from work. Yeah. If you did the first one like that, you're gonna lose your fish. It, it'll split right here. Go through the gill, out through the mouth. First one? On the first, or well, all of them. Yeah. You already done cost him one fish. I'm just saying. He cost him one fish. string itself but the metal loop ain't welded it's just closed you can open it up like this with your hand you take your mouth Like five of them. Pick one and go through. <clears throat> yeah, now, now you go through there. Through here. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Through oh, the blue oh, through first. Yeah. first one. And then the other one just slide yeah. it through. Yep. Appreciate you, man. Appreciate mm -hmm. you. I'm a poor ass mess, I need to eat some of I hate losing fish. <laughs> I had to learn the hard way with all those tricks I just showed you. <laughs> so these what? Yeah, go through the grill. grill. Yeah, the same way. If you can go to grill to grill. Mm -hmm. Get them, yeah, one day it got to the point. Anything less than those that smaller one, the middle one, uh -huh. we threw it back. I was crazy. I had I had about a 25 foot of the thick ass yellow one. Mm -hmm. I had all the sheep head on there yesterday. Well, I guess the way took it under the jetty and I couldn't pull it out. Wow, well, fucking crazy. He was the one catching on the one. Mm -hmm. This part broke. Yeah, he was catching all of them, but I guess we're ready to go. Fuck my shit up. Right there, it's about to say they caught a nine foot tarpon on a ball ball pier with it. Yeah. I caught a guard with that little four footer, mm -hmm. little one like that one. I think it was a two. Yeah. I was going for redfish <laughs> and they took up, they picked up a three inch perch. Oh, dang, right like I was dropping right there because they were coming right around the pylons. Uh -huh. but right there is where you hooked up with it. Came up and shoot. Yeah. Yep, and the fight was on. Likes you still filleting fish in there? Yeah, go ask him. He'll take it. Yeah, those are good. Yeah, those are pretty good. <laughs> I just hate to 
the little slimy crap they leave behind. Yeah. Is it? Really a fun fish are the chum salmon. The what? Chum salmon. I never heard of those. Out of Washington State. Oh. Freshwater. Okay. No, no. And they're salt water? Salt water. Oh. And they're oh, called the chum ocean. salmon? Hey, your boat, your boat, your boat. Shit happens. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Last year I had my beard just a little bit longer than yours, mm. and it started getting it. I had spaghetti dinner the one night. <laughs> Man, <laughs> I have <was> shaved then. <laughs> For me, I was out here, and a southeast wind came in, and it was slapping me in the eyeball. Oh, yeah, so, I yeah. so I took off six inches. So I was yep. like, I'm good. <laughs> yeah, no, it was, it was down to here. Yeah, it gets a little bit. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, you get to a certain point, man. That's. <laughs> I was letting my buddy and his father-in-law catch because they've never been out there. What was it? That was a speckled job. Oh! Oh, you probably eating on that back of shrimp right there. <laughs> hey, that black rod just got smart. He's on there and he slacked up your line big time. Shop address, phone number, and everything. 
Dang, <laughs> it's like having a fish on there. <laughs> so what I'm doing is I'm using those holes right now. And I'm wrapping them with the bait elastic. You hear me talking most of the time, I'm just talking to the camera, so oh. <laughs> you're like, what's she talking about? <laughs> Nice drum too. Yep. That's a beast. Good catch. Oh, my, you got one. <laughs> Dang, that was oh, cool. It's like 20 in one. 
Yeah, yeah. What? It has to be from here to here big. He looks a little cast. That's a beast of a cat, so. Look, look. You don't have teeth, can you hold them like that? Oh, you can just pick it yeah, in or anything. Look, just grab them like that and hold them like this. Pick them up. Yeah, there you go. Can I cut it? <laughs> yeah. Thank you so much. Do I cut it? Uh, it's over 30. 30? Oh, yeah. So hold it by the... Like yeah, you can. Right here? Yeah, you can. Right here? Hold on, babe. This lady just got one. Oh, yeah. Ooh. 36 inches. Barely. Yeah. Just hold them by the... Thank you so much. Hold them by the... Oh, no, no. Go in by the gill. Right here? Yep. All the way in. You'll feel it. Toward the front. Yeah, there you go. Oh, it's a big male. There you go. By the tail, uh, yeah. There you go. <laughs> Come on, girl. There you go. Come on. Come on. You caught him. <laughs> you caught him. There you go, homie. Yeah, oh. yeah. All right. What are you sprinkling on him? Right. Huh? What are you sprinkling on your shit? Your dad. Wrapping them, you mean? Ooh. That cold. Good job, baby. Wow. Good job. Thank you. Good job. Thank you, guys. Would you see yeah, you see the video on my Team Hard Life YouTube channel. Oh, you have a, a channel? Oh, yeah. man, I'll definitely check what that out. What is it called? Team Hard Life. You want to take a picture of that? I got it right here so they can take a picture of it. I'm going to um, go wash my hands. All right, go for it. There's a water thing right there with that guy in the bluest. Oh, okay. Yeah, we got 20 hours uh, back home, so I'll definitely, I'll watch YouTube Where all the way there, Chicago. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. I was watching YouTube all the way here, so I'll definitely check you out, man. Oh, yeah. For sure, for sure. We like, do a lot of coastal okay. shore fishing. Go tell your friends, look, I was fishing with him this weekend. Exactly. Exactly. I, 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 I do everything. Nice. You ever do collabs with other uh, YouTubers? You uh, yeah, I've done with uh, Type Pig Patrol, uh, Catching Dinosaurs. Nice. Uh, Team Real Locals. Uh, <clears throat> I used to watch a lot of Florida guys, but then they started getting like, kind of like clickbaity. Like, oh, I caught a shark today, and it really be a uh, Picassoness or something. You're like, come on, man. Yeah. <laughs> Whatever it crazy. takes. Though. Some of those guys that are huge, I was actually helping them uh, with their fishing tackle because they barely, they were barely getting into the shark fishing world. Uh, well, I'd already done held land-based world records and stuff like that. So nice. I was helping them. And then when I finally started my channel, I got with them. I was like, hey man, you mind giving me a shout out? And they didn't, they didn't, wanna... they didn't even respond to the messages. Damn, like, oh, that's that? shady, man. Uh, that land shark fishing was a blow. Yeah, dude, he's like 300 something subscribers or whatever. Yeah, he's got a photo. Yeah, I helped him out, dude. I got hundreds of messages back and forth. Yeah. He blew up. And Got, yeah, you don't need him. Mm-hmm. Uh, you better have not even better fucking people like that. No, hell no. I can't do it.